So there's a rumor going around that Tommy Nibs, the owner of Enharmonic Studios, is selling it because business has been doing really bad. See, now I didn't believe it at first until he left the voicemail saying he would really appreciate us showing up to the studio today. And that's Tommy's nice voice. I hear the studio might be going out of business, but it's cool because I've been going out in a lot of auditions and getting kicked out of a lot of auditions for minor things like not bringing my headshots, forgetting my lines, handcuffing myself to the casting director's leg, you know, minor stuff like that. Everybody does it. Showbiz. I can't believe they might close down the studio before I complete my new album. And I just finished a new love song for it too. It's called Morning Breath. Here's a little preview. You don't have to rush to brush. You don't have to waste your toothpaste. Because I love the way your morning breath tastes. We're only 30 minutes late. They weren't watching us. Oh my. Ladies, what are you doing here? Hey, fellas. I'm stage and screens Lynn Miranda, and I own all this now. That's mine. Eso es mío. Eso es mío. Todo esto es mío. I'm actually really excited Lynn's new boss. That means I have a really good chance of getting hired. I mean, Lynn and I are like brothers. Wait, you guys are brothers? I mean, we, we met once in elevator. But those 10 floors feel like forever. Top three favorite actors. Pre-Fat Marlon Brando, pre jack the Face Mickey Rourke, and Lin-Manuel. I like Lynn so much, I made a play called Out of the Heights. And it actually ran for a couple of days until I was legally forced to stop performing it. For some reason, Lynn's lawyer wasn't a fan of the show. While Bago and Ant line up in front of Lynn's ass to kiss it, I'm gonna do the opposite. Because celebrities respect people more when they don't treat them like celebrities. And after Lynn sees how cool I play it, he'll probably offer me a job. Or offer me a chance to become a permanent member of his entourage. And you know I'm accepting that. Lynn, what's up, man? Hey, I'm talking about C. Have, uh, have we met? <coughs> Uh, yeah, remember that one time, uh, elevator, 10 floors? Oh, we rode the elevator together. Yeah. Oh, good. How you doing? Still riding elevators? Actually, I got my elevator license last year, so now I can own and operate my own elevator. <laughs> right. Are you serious? Lynn, 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 fellow actor here, who one day hopes to be half as successful as you are. Oh, well, that's very sweet of you. What are you working on now? Well, I have a one-man show that didn't start off as a one-man show because everybody I asked to be in it didn't want to be in it. But maybe you, you want to be... No, no, but you're great. I think you're great. Lynn, look, I'm not going to get all fanboy on you. Uh, to be honest, I haven't even seen In the Heights. Yeah, I stopped following Broadway once they canceled Cats. Mm. Canceled. Yeah, you remember that show about the cats? Yeah, Andrew Lloyd Webber, sure. Was he one of the cats? Yeah, he was all the cats. That's the twist. Listen, guys, I know this is an awkward situation and to have your jobs taken from you and there's no Liam Neeson to call to get him back. But I have good news. I have enough money for one of you to work in the studio with me. Now, I've done some research and these girls have worked with you in the past, so they're going to tell me which of you has the best studio skills. My hope is at the end of this unnecessarily elaborate process, I will have a new employee. I'm bored now. So I'm gonna go. I'll uh, hear about the results later. All right. Bye, Lynn. Later, elevator. <laughs> cool nickname. Let's get straight to the competition. First up, we'll be shooting. Who brought their camera with them? Yep. I have my camera right here, and I also have a laptop and editing equipment with me if you need it. And why do you have every single electronic device known to man? It's like your PC Richard or PC Richard's son. Ant wins the challenge since he was the only one who brought a camera. But I bought the camera! Yeah, and I waited in the car while he bought it in the store because his car was double parked. I said Ant won the challenge. And if you guys continue arguing with me, each one of you will lose a point, okay? <gasps> You know what, this competition is going to be harder than I thought.
Gentlemen, I've talked to the ladies and the results are in. They're locked in a safety deposit box in Grand Central Station. You have 30, I'm kidding, Anthony. Damn. Uh, Lynn, I really appreciate the opportunity, but I'm gonna have to respectfully decline. <laughs> Wait a minute, you're turning down an opportunity to work for me and possibly become a member of my entourage? The thing is, these guys, they're not just my co-workers. And they're not even just my friends. They're, they're my family. I think he's leaning on too thick. I know, right? That hits me right where I live, man. Right below the rib cage, next to the breastbone, near the guts and stuff. All right, I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna own the studio, but I'm gonna let you guys run it. I see how you guys care about each other. And it reminds me of something my friend Andrew Lloyd Webber said, AL Dubs, love changes everything. Who's Andrew Lloyd? He's a cat. Oh, wait, what? Excuse me. I gotta lead a parade downtown in a half hour. I'll see you guys later. I'm having major entourage envy right now. And that's like the nicest thing anyone's ever done for Jamie. It's true. At. My parents never loved me. Well, the way I see it, they can only be one group of studio heads. Studio heads! That could be the name of our softball team! Studio heads on three! One, one two, two, three! three studio heads. heads! Hey, uh, your friend left without pain? Who's taking care of this? Run on three! One, one two, three, run! Hey! 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 hey. 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 